So today's discussion is um, how to ask for a review when you've earned it. So did you know that 68% of consumers um, that left, 68% of consumers um, will leave a review when asked. So all you got to do is just ask for it. <laughs> Okay, that's the end of my show today. Bye. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> so uh, first and foremost, I'd like to let you know that if you'd like to take our um, online reputation quiz to find out what your online reputation score is, simply just type in the comments below reputation quiz, and we can get that going for you and answer any questions that you have. Um, yesterday, I discussed some very specific statistics as far as why online reviews are important for your business. And so I'm going to share my screen and show you what some of them are to kind of give you a quick recap of what we discussed yesterday. But let me stretch my screen out here real quick. Here we go. All right. So 85% of consumers trust online reviews as much as a personal recommendation. So if you are looking for word of mouth online, definitely ask for a review uh, when you've earned it. <laughs> Very important. <laughs> um, positive reviews make 73% of a consumer trust a local business more. And 97% of individuals look online for local businesses. Now this comes from a 2017 um, consumer review survey. And so I just want to, you know, let you know it reviews are good. <laughs> They're really good for your business. How else can I describe that? And I'm kind of nervous. So just give me that too. <laughs> um, but another thing is 74%, uh, you know, will leave their feedback if you just ask for it. And so um, what I'm going to do here is stop sharing just for a second. So Today's discussion, like I said, is going to be a how to ask for a review when you've earned it. And the way that we do that is we use what we call the two W's, which I'll get to in just a second. I just want to give you an example. So um, have you ever worked on a project to where you were just super proud, you knew it was an incredible project and the outcome, the results of it were phenomenal. And then you just kind of walk away feeling accomplished. And two weeks later, you think, oh, I should have asked for a review. And so you send a message to ask for a review and it's like crickets or the re review you see you receive doesn't seem as awesome as it should have been because, you know, you should have asked when it was two weeks ago when the project was done. So I'm kind of trying to attach something here um, to give you an example. So that you're encouraged somewhat this week to really be aware and pay attention to um, what's going on with some of the projects or you know that uh, one is going to finish soon and you can just simply ask for a review. So um, in that survey that I just showed you, it's been discovered, like I said, 97% of consumers read online reviews for local businesses and 12% of that are looking every day on just Yelp and Facebook. Um, so with stats like that, I definitely want to encourage you to start requesting reviews that you earned from helping clients achieve their goals using what we call the two W's. So here they are, what and why. <clears throat> so imagine that you just finished helping a client achieve their goal and overcome an obstacle, which means you've earned the right to ask for a review. So when asking for a review, provide guidance with a focus to make sure that you're targeting your correct audience. So you could say something like, hey, it's been an honor working with you. Will you please leave me a review to help us share our great service with others by stating one, what benefits that you received? What benefits did you receive from working with us? And two, why would you recommend us? And so your um, Review is going to be specific. It's going to um, be towards the correct target audience and it's going to have some neat keywords in it as well. So how, what, what do keywords do? Well, you can be found on Google, for example, by a phrase, by a product or by a service. And if you have that in your reviews, that's even better. <laughs> it's like a bonus. And so, um, um, 
to learn more, you know, you can also automate this process. So to learn more how to automate this process, just get in contact with me at m.me slash accelerate marketing. And I can respond back to you within 15 minutes from the time you sent a messenger message, whether it's video message or audio message or text. Um, and we can have a simple conversation. Or if you have some questions, send them to me. And I could definitely uh, help you with that as well. Monday through Friday, I sign in to share some successful strategies with you on how to become the go-to business in your niche. So this week, I'm talking about reviews and your online reputation. Next week will be all about local SEO. And the week after that is Google My Business because we all know that beast is beautiful. <laughs> so my homework for you today is to um, pay attention to your surroundings and, and um, your projects and, and kind of look at your timeline and see when they'll be finished and plan to ask for a review because you've definitely earned it. And let me know how it goes. Tomorrow, I'll be discussing what to do with those reviews once you've received them. And also, don't forget to uh, type in the word online reputation to, to discover what your online reputation score is. I'm going to sign in real quick and see if there are any questions before I sign off. Perfect. Um, and if you're watching the replay, thank you. <laughs> and leave a message as well. Create a great rest of your day, friends, and talk to you soon. Bye.